Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you probably the quickest, fastest updo you will ever do in your life. Um, my hair is already curled, so step one, curl your hair. It's gonna look the best with curled hair like this. I actually used this wand from Sultra, so you can see it is a flat iron. So I just took my hair literally like this, and then I flat wrapped it, meaning I kept my hair flat and wrapped it all the way around for each section. Um, and then I just altered the directions that I went all around my head. And then I brushed everything out and then these are the curls that I was left with. So yeah, if you're curious how I got my curls, that is how and I will link the iron in my description box. So I have to show you guys this because it makes me laugh, but my shirt shrunk in the dryer and as you know, I'm six months pregnant. So let me just show you what I look like right now. <laughs> Isn't this sexy? <laughs> Look at this. Isn't this sexy? Hi. Like, I think I need to get rid of the shirt now because it's worthless. <laughs> okay, so grab some bobby pins and some clear elastics and let's get into it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do first is just use this Moroccan oil dry texture spray. This stuff smells so good. Mmm. So we're just giving our hair some texture. And then next, I'm just gonna leave some hair out in the front and then split my hair. I don't have a lot of hair on this side. And then I'm just gonna split my hair into two sections. Okay guys, hopefully this audio doesn't sound like total shit because I'm doing it off my MacBook rather than my actual microphone. Um, but what you just want to do is separate your hair into two equal sections or somewhat equal. And I'm just going to take the bottom section and I'm going to take a clear elastic and I'm going to put it through twice. And then the third time, I'm just going to do like a little bun at the top. So don't pull your hair all the way through just a little bit, just kind of fluff it out a little bit, then take the remainder of the hair and then tuck it up into the clear elastic. So it makes just like a little bun like this and then fluff out that bottom section. And then I just bobby pinned one bobby pin into the top of it and then fluffed it out a little bit more. Okay, so then just let down the top half of your hair and basically you are going to do the exact same thing. So I accidentally left a little piece out but it ended up looking okay, so it's fine if you do that too. So again, just pull your hair through the third time or second time and just do like a little bun. Don't pull all the way through. I accidentally pulled too much through, but it worked out fine. And then tuck the bottom section into the elastic and then pull it out. And you can see it's just kind of messy, but we'll fix it. Um, just kind of fluff it out a little bit more. And then what I'm just gonna do is kind of bobby pin some of those loose ends into place. Um, and then I'm gonna take some bangs in the front. That's just a little bit too much of bangs. And I'm just going to give it a little bit of a twist and then pancake it, kind of fluff it out a little bit. And then I'm going to take that section and just bobby pin it towards the back of my head and just kind of push it into the little updo part. And then I'm going to spray some more Moroccan oil texture spray, just kind of pull and tug on the rest of my head. And then I'm going to take a Mika hairspray, just kind of spray that all over. Don't spray it in your mouth turn around and then this is it so you can see it is messy but it just looks so cute um, I love the added texture from the curls and it just I don't know it's perfect for really any type of event everyday occasion whatever you name it this is good for it so I hope you like this tutorial please don't forget to subscribe leave a comment thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video Mwah! bye